Okay. So let's see. So I've uh, gotten some uh, increased the ammo capacity for my handgun, and I've also increased the firepower. At least I believe I remember increased. I remember increased the firepower. Okay. All right. So I've cleared out this area right now. Let me just check the map. Yep. Okay. Now watch this. So I'm not gonna mess with those traps for right now. Okay. I took care of the birds over here. Now, usually when you come and trigger Dr. Salvador, uh, two Ganados will also come and, well, let's just say ruin your day. But there is a trick to get them to come before Salvador shows up. Okay. If you listen closely, you can hear him. Oh, yeah. Alright, first... Okay. I already destroyed the... A... Oh yeah, I almost forgot to mention, uh, back in the village, or it was in the... F or it was in the hunting lodge? Not the hunting lodge, that, uh... What do you call it? It's that, um... Let's see. I'm trying to think. Yeah. Okay. It's like, they should be showing up right about now. You can... Okay, here he comes. Oh, okay. Alright, come on. Alright, come on. This way, this way, this way, this way. Come on, go, 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 go. Come on. Follow me. I got a, tr I got a present for you. Okay. Yep. Here. Right here, right here. Ready? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ready? Gotcha! Alright. This way, this way, this way, this way. <laughs> Come on. How many times did you practice, practice uh, this? I only did this once, and I meant to melee him, not stab him with a knife. Oh boy. I only did this once, but it's like the Salvador fight, though, I struggle with. But now that, now that those Ganados are out of the way, they won't be able to distract me when I go in to kill Salvador. Oh, almost forgot. Gotta reload this puppy. Yeah! <laughs> now. And here he comes! Oh, also, you can use, um, a crossbow... This way, this way, come on! And... Oh! Nailed him! Quick! No. Oh! Oh, shoot! Ugh. Get down! Okay. Reload, reload. Oh, he's already dead! <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, got him! Mm. Now that is how we do it! <laughs> oh, yes. Okay, fine. Uh, yes. Do you think his um face is like a exposed plaga, or what do you think's behind that mask? That's what I wonder, too, because, like, I mean, in the original, it looked, you know, normal, but here it looks unnatural, like there's something very wrong with it. Oh, I almost forgot. I could also use this to, you know, take him down, but I'm not going to disarm the trap just in case there's, you know. Oh, also, I, um, back at the um, place where the fishing boats were, there was also a bird nest, and that made me think I may have missed some uh, way back. Ah, oh, come on, shoot. That, um, yeah, these uh, bear traps are next level. Yeah, there is a mod, which I didn't bother to download, which makes them bl uh, which makes them blood red, and you can see them. So, uh, so you can see them more clearly. Like, I mean, I suppose they'll be more useful, like, say, in uh, areas with rotten grass. Um, uh, with uh, areas with grass, I mean. Uh... Oh yeah, I also have to use my ears to hear for those wind-up buzz toys. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh boy. Let's see how... Ooh. Let's see. Okay. 
Let's see. Okay, so there's multiple ways to get in. Hmm. Let me just, uh... I'm not sure what that does, but I just... Let's see, uh... Okay. I'm pretty sure I can't go through here yet. Yeah, I need a key. Oh, this uh, house also looks very familiar. So let's see. Okay, so I can't go in through the front entrance. Alright, so I can't go in through the front entrance, but... Um... Okay, and I can't see any... Um... Any bird nest to shoot, so yeah. The, yeah, I agree. These bear traps are next level. Um, no, uh, it's like I don't. I don't know. I don't know whether or not I should uh, download the mod. Oh, come on! I not. I'm not sure whether or not I should download the mod to uh, make the bear traps bright red. But after that one, I'm thinking, you know what? Maybe it's not such a bad idea to get that mod. Oh boy. Okay. Okay. Oh yeah, here's a nice house. Ooh, some garlic. Oh yeah, I wonder if that guy's here who's take who's taking a dump. Whoop! Ruby. Okay. Not too shabby. Someone has shown up their neighbors. Okay. Well, um, having learned from my lesson from that, um, no. is there an? Oh, <gasps> yes, an egg. Having learned my lesson from that, um, what's it called again? Um, uh, from that uh, little uh, ho uh. Who's oh, oh, yes! Another small key. Having learned my lesson from remember that uh where all those Ganados start funneling in through the um, Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, well like I kept that one this like the only way in was through the window and I could have, you know, unlocked the door but I didn't. Okay. Alright. Alright, so let's see. Okay. Let's see. Uh at last flesh of our flesh, blood of our blood, give thanks and rejoice. Okay. Let's see. I'm pretty sure I have to go upstairs, but um, I'm just gonna examine the downstairs for right now. Let's see. So far, I've mm, look. We got a mm, uh, look right there. We've got a uh, phone. So uh, I don't remember seeing a phone in the OG. So that's new. Some pesetas. Aha! Flesh of our flesh and blood of our blood. Okay. That is a puzzle. So let's see. That must look for clues, and also I really appreciate it if Leon used his, uh, if like there was a way to manually display the flashlight instead of you know, because some of these yeah, areas I think only, uh, are, I I think feel... only ever used it in like complete darkness. Yeah, because like I feel like some of these areas, like even here, let me just go to my, let's see if I can go to my settings and adjust the brightness. Okay, now let's see. Okay. There we go. So, now we got ourselves some... Woo! <laughs> a rather explosive cluster, if I do say so myself. Okay. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Alright. That looks important. Okay. Illuminados 4-3. In great veneration of their master, the people offered up the most prized possessions. The old father's finest crop. The slight swineherd, his stoutest pig, the beggarly grandma, her beloved babe. The master saw these gifts and was pleased. Okay. So let's see. So crop, pig, and babe. So I think I have an idea. So that crop would most likely mean wheat, and um, pig obviously means swine. Nailed it! Okay. I love that you take the time to find the puzzle, whereas in my playthrough, I gave it like 10 tries before I actually decided to do it the right way. <laughs> ooh, ooh, crystal marble. So that's no treasure, but a key item. Because of that. Whoa. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Okay, hey, come on. Didn't, didn't anybody ever tell you it's bad manners to reach across the table? Now, where did that humdinger... Oh, okay. The humdinger came, I guess, from upstairs. Unless he came through there. I mean, that door's locked. So, um... Okay. Let's see now. 
Oh, I'm also going to try to uh, keep these in one-minute sessions. Um, not not one-minute, one-hour sessions. Um, oh, boy. Oh, yeah, I'm glad you said that. I, I was wanting to mention that. Okay, yeah, because, like, other... Because it took two hours to... Uh, because it... Because a two-hour-long session took just way too long to get to the drive. I'm going to try and keep it at an hour. Yeah, okay. it took a while to get through editing as well. Okay. All right. I'm getting, um, I'm getting close to finishing up the uh, first one. All right, good. Okay, so let's see. All right, window. That looks very familiar. Ooh, plug a key. Hmm. Okay, nothing to shoot down from up here. And there's... I'm just like, given how high, huge that cabinet is, I would be—I'd bet anything that the chief is hiding in that in that closet. Okay, but let's see. All right, all right. Village Records, Volume Three, Date October 10th. The weather has been strange of late. The wheat withers and the cows grow thin. Date December 8th. There are signs of famine. It is true. We lack the means to work the fields, but Lord Sadler's orders are absolute. Date January 30th. 30 people have starved to death. Five cows will be slaughtered. Date March 11th. The patriarchs ca gather to cast lots. Six more chosen for Lord Sadler. Date April 8th. April. Eight more today. Date four more today. Date, 11 more today. Oh boy, this is giving me uh, old vibes to back to re one. Date, two outsiders got lost and wandered into the village. We took them to the altar for the ritual. No need to cast lots today. Sound like Palpatine over here. Oh yeah, I. I don't know. I have to study Batora's men. Oh boy. Well, that's a sinister looking fellow, and definitely not the type I get along with. Her. Execute Order 66. Six, yep. I'm... Because, like, John Wolf um, uh, on Harshly Critical, when he did his Ultimate... Uh, Re4 Ultimate HD edition, he tried to do voices for, like, Sadler, and I'm trying to imitate him as best as I could. So we got this insignia key. Aha! Oh! There he is! Yeah! See? Shoot him! <laughs> Accepted the gift. Okay, so that's the end of that chapter. Okay. Yeah, I love how they do that in this version compared to the original where it's all in one thing rather than how in the original you, you would have to go back into the room to get the other half of the cutscene. Yeah. Because a lot of times you would miss out on, on your first playthrough because you wouldn't really think to go back. You'd be moving forward. Yeah. Okay. All right, so... Uh... Bruce Seconder 1... I've got that intel you requested on Louis Sarah. It seems he used to be a researcher for Umbrella. Umbrella? I should have left him in that bag to rot. <laughs> I'm sending you the details. Take a look, but Baby Eagle is your priority. Copy that. Making my way to the church. Condor 1, out. <clears throat> okay, we're back. So let's take a look at what we got on Louis Sarah. Got the scribbles of the dolls, photo of the family. Louis Sarah report. Okay. Louis Sarah Navarro. Uh, age 28, gender male. Sarah's name first appears publicly in a university uh, student registry. No prior records have been discovered, including his birth certificate. 
After graduating from university, he was employed at, by Umbrella's research division, where he became a rising star who won favor among his peers. He was involved in the development of several common over-the-counter drugs, all of which were discontinued before ever reaching the market. See attached list for details. A few years later, S Sarah reassigned from Umbrella and could not be relocated. Re resigned. Not reassigned. Resigned. After the Raccoon City in incident, efforts were made by law enforcement and the government to track down anyone with links to Umbrella, but despite conducting an extensive research, they were unable to find him. Considering how well he evaded them, we are almost certain that Sarah went to di great lengths to disappear. In Hunnigan's handwriting, common over-the-counter drugs, do you seriously think uh, Umbrella would let one of their best worker uh, best work on some antacid or beauty cream? <laughs> well, yeah. Get rich quick! All the requests coming along. Did you know you can trade the spinels you receive as reward for valuable goods that can't be bought otherwise? Oh, I remember reading that, so I guess, well, I reckon that's that. Okay. So, uh, what are your thoughts on Luis being a part of Umbrella? I mean, okay, it does make a little bit more logical sense uh, compared from, like, how the original where he says, like, I used to be a cop in Madrid. And so, like, I mean, they could have used him as, like, a cop for cover, but after I think about it, it probably would have worked so well. Okay. Like, it wouldn't make much sense, so um, I guess we're going to head out right now. Oh, <gasps> hold the phone. I missed this. I'll... Oh yeah, it, of course, there was a guy in here who was doing his business. Oh, a toilet. At least they're somewhat civilized. Yep. <laughs> okay. Oh, let me check yeah. the map. Okay. Yeah, my only thing with the Umbrella and Luis is it just kind of makes the world feel smaller. Yeah. That he's conveniently was a part of Umbrella, <gasps> and he grew up at this village. It's my boy! You, huh? Oh, my poor boy! I'm coming, I'll save you. Don't worry, I'll save you. Come on. Oh. Aw. Take care of yourself, buddy. <laughs> yep. Now, okay, back in the OG, when he was talking about, like, um, when... When, you know, when he first gets, uh, grabbed by Mendez, um, he says, So, you carry the same blood as us. If you ever become unpleasant to our eyes, there will be severe consequences. But, so, like, in this one, though, it still feels like they shortened it, but maybe that was done just so that they could have Ada in that one scene, rather than having them in separate scenes, like in the OG. I just checked oh, yeah. the map and I realized I missed a treasure. So, I mean, it's also interesting that he infected Leon. Yep. Instead of a random uh, um, cultist, I think is what it was in the original. Yeah. Okay. So let's... I, I do have a theory that he was going to infect Luis. Because Luis was originally infected, but got the plaga out of him. Yep. I feel like he was going to infect Luis, but then Leon was there, so he was like, oh, I guess we'll do this. Yep. Inlay gemstone. So I'm just going to... This is this is just going to be an experiment. Um, Okay, so that's... Let's see. I want to see if I can make it to 5,000 or beyond. I mean, 50,000 or beyond. Okay. Okay. Oh, yeah, there was a locked drawer! <sighs> okay. I just... I feel like... I, I feel like I missed an, another small key, because this was... Because there was... I feel like there was a small key back in the factory that I missed, so... Let me... S uh, so, I'm gonna head back to the factory. Uh, um, well, to that place where we were before. Do you have a small key for it? Ah! There it is! For a reason, stranger. Okay, so that that's the so that's the thing I missed. Okay. So uh just cut to the part where I get the key. Uh when you're doing foot rendering. Okay. Check it. Yep, she's still up there. There it is! Haha! -ha! I found it. Okay. 
Now. Okay, 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 okay. That's the key I was missing. Oh, it's actually, no, it's not the key, it's a spin up. Let's see. But I feel like there was a key, like, around here somewhere. I swear there was, like, a key somewhere around here. Uh, cause... There's also this one mod where... Oh! <gasps> is this it? Yes! There it is! Got the small key! Okay. There was also this mod where the merchant will trade spinels for small keys. And, uh, I just, it's like, and looking back at that, because back then, the merchant, I believe, also sold, uh, lockpicks back in, uh, the, the Duke sold lockpicks back in, uh, Resident Evil 8. And I just feel like that's something the merchant in, um, in re, uh, uh, Remake 4 would also do. So, but it's, it seems like Capcom may have forgotten to do that. But thankfully, the fans fixed it for us. So well, he does, he does definitely function differently because the Duke in 8 also sold ammo individually, yeah. whereas the merchant doesn't do that. Yep. Doesn't even sell resources to craft with, so you gotta scavenge for those yourself using either um, just as how that you are, or using the perks with your attaché case. Or let's see. Oh my gosh! So a sapphire. <laughs> okay. Sorry, I just I really gotta start using my ears more in this game, and also. It is kind of nice, actually, now that to have the dog kind of show up in, um, you know, show up after Mendez rather than in, um, you know, at the, at the beginning, because, yep. I know, maybe it just foreshadows a little bit later that the dog's going to be important. I'm not sure. Okay. All right, well, let's see if we can get through this gate now. All right. Okay, keeping an eye out for any more wind-up toys or... Um... Man, that ham looks... I could go for a nice uh, slice of ham. Okay. Alright. I don't see anything up in the rafters. Because one of the things back in RE4 is that you would shoot things that were, like, stuck on ceilings and, and stuff. Okay, so bats can't be hit. So I got eight sp spinels right now. Okay. Back in the village. <gasps> Let's see. I'm trying to... Okay. Back in the village. Okay, I'm trying to remember... Map. Let's see. Um, typewriter Hunter's Lodge. I can't go back. I, that I can't go back because that was a one-way trip. Let's see. Was there a like? Your uh, shotgun loaded. Oh. Um. Yes. Got my shotgun. <gasps> There's a bird up there as well. Here, I'm just gonna use bolts to take down the gear. I'm gonna show you the uh, the enhanced uh, bolt mod. Okay. So 
uh, because the bolts make no noise compared to guns, um, you can basically shoot a, uh, as long as you have all the bolts, you can basically shoot all the birds. Yeah, and the good uh, thing without... is you can, get, you can get your bolt back. Yeah, and you can get your bolt back. Oh, crap! What the? Oh, crap! Alright, here we go! Yeah, that's why I wanted to make sure your gun was loaded. Okay. Oh! Next. Okay. Where are they? Come on! Come on! Okay, come on, get up, get up, get up. Yeah, it's all... <laughs> okay. Well, I only got pounced once, so it's really not that bad. Oh, come on! You get... Yeah, I love, how, I love how they did that. Yeah, because otherwise you'd be able to easily, you know... <gasps> crap! Crap, 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 not again! Gotcha! Okay. Let's see. Cuz there I believe there was like a uh, thing to un a, a um Uh I hear somebody. That's locked. Okay. Gotta think. Okay, I got a trap here. And the chickens are all gone. Huh. This is blocked. Okay. Wow, they're really going out they're really going out of the way their way to block me. So, um yeah. Did you ever use the small key on this door or this drawer? Which one? Oh, that one, the right. one right there. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, I was just trying to remember like where is the Where is this thing? Okay. Ooh, a vintage compass. Let me see. Okay, vintage. We'll be back in a minute, I gotta get a water. Alright. Okay. Poor cow's dead. Okay, that's blocked. Wow, they're really going out of their way to keep me from moving around. Okay, nothing to break back here. Nothing to break here. And I can't vault over here. Let's just go. Okay. They're looking for it. Yep. So yeah, I just cause like it's really impressive how they've really gone out of your way to their way to block you. Like, you can't take all those routes you remember. Nope, can't do them now. It's like all those routes you remember, cause like We've essentially screwed with the village, other than setting traps, so... Okay. Now I can finally go down here. Okay. Alright. I can hear them. Is there I really wish they oh. had brought the slide. Oh! From Resident Evil 6. Uh, what slide? Um, you know the little uh, slide mechanic that game had. Oh yeah, it's yeah. Oh yeah, that. Rats. Pest control. It's time for pest control. 
Careful, it might contain the T-Virus. Oh, yes, of course. Oh, also, like, I was thinking of, like, I don't know, maybe, like, new ideas, like, ah. I was thinking of new, like, uh, ideas for Resident Evil games, and I just thought, and I was thinking about, um, I was thinking about, um, what's it called again, uh, Ireland and the Loch Ness Monster, and I thought, like, you know what would be a great idea for, like, uh, to have, like, have a Resident Evil game that takes place in Ireland, if they're gonna do, you go to Ireland next, and, um, Maybe have monsters that are similar to leprechauns or something, and then, like, uh, there's, like, this underwater... Oh! Oh! Underwater... Uh, underwater facility that is, like, um... Out of the way! This underwater facility, and, like, they discover that the Loch Ness Monster is, in fact, real, and it's, like, a dinosaur that everybody thought... It's, like, it's actually a species of dinosaur everybody thought was extinct. So yeah, so yeah. Now they're staggering a lot more when I hit the, when I hit them, shoot, when I shoot them in the head. Yeah, that'll help me save on bullets. Oh. <laughs> oh. I also increased the power and durability of my knife, so that's good. So so that there's that. Oh, uh, from the merchant. Yeah. I mean, I could have, like... Okay, let's see. Well, in this case, I am going to have to disarm this one. Okay. Do you think Krauser put those traps there? Probably. I wouldn't... It's like, I wouldn't be surprised if it was him. I mean, considering I that... I don't... What was that? Uh, considering that, like, uh, during that uh, Krauser fight, there was, like, all those explosives, all those timed explosives mm -hmm. on the building. Now I can't use this to cheat anymore when I bring Ashley... When I come back with Ashley. Oh, yeah. Yep. Wait, what's this? So, wait, I came from this way, right? I'm getting confused. Let me just... Okay. Yeah, I think okay. that's where you came in. Okay, that's where I came in. So, I basically just, uh, I took the long way around, and then, like, but I at least I got myself some nice treasures. Now, let's use the insignia key. Yep. All right. I didn't see anything in the. <gasps> oh! Oh my gosh! Snake! A viper! What can I? Okay. Examine. Let's see. Medium-sized snake. It was like. If the poison glands are removed, it may be eaten. Okay, but how do I remove the poison glands? That's the question. Because, like... <laughs> I'm actually glad that they brought the snakes back. And that, that means you have to have real quick reflexes. It's just, I'm so used to a snake popping out, I'm just like... <laughs> I gotta just, you know, point and click. Yeah, and I love that you actually get the snake instead of a random chicken egg. Yeah, I mean snakes. Some there are plenty. There are plenty of snakes that do lay eggs, but um, let's see. Yeah, but it never said snake egg. It always said chicken, chicken egg. egg. Yeah, so insinuating that like Leon ripped the thing open, took the egg it just ate out to eat it himself. Yeah, and the other thing too is egg snakes don't really have teeth, so there's that, and this, that, yeah, that, so there's that problem. Eggs, because otherwise they, otherwise if they did have teeth, they would break the e uh, the egg would break before they swallowed it. Okay. All right. Hey, actually, I believe there's some kind of like achievement for throwing egg at the fi at, at, at at the pictures, but I don't know. I'd rather save just so I don't waste an egg. I just you know like Illuminados four nine. Sleep well and flourish, dear child. As your body grows, your mothers shall sew you new small clothes. At seven quintal of wheat and half a bowl a day, you have outgrown your pen. 
blurnish, dear child, for the sake of your brothers and sisters who cannot. Oh, boy. Well, that's just spooky. I wonder if there's something in there. Okay. Aha! I knew there was a noise. I'd like some peace and quiet. So if it's not peace and full and quiet, then there's definitely something about. There's a lot of these. Okay. We got a treasure chest. First aid spray, I'll sell that for monies. Some shotgun shells. I better reload, just in case. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna craft some shotgun shells, so. <laughs> yes. Now, I got some shotgun shells. So let's see. I have some new goods that might interest you. Well, now. Merchant tip, the prudent choice. Sick of corns to live on another, Amo. Well, have I got a treat for you. The bolt throw is something else, mate. Its metal bolts can be retrieved and reused, so you can keep shooting forever. Also, don't forget to buy the bolt recipe to turn your extra knives to ammo. Your extra knives into well bolts. Never worry about ammo again. And that's not all. You can affix the bolts with attachable mines, proximity explosives, to ex quickly turn the weapon into a powerful mine thrower. Shoot at an enemy to see them explode instantly, or at a surface to set a proximity mine. You'll lose the boat, but it'll be worth it. Okay. Well, that sounds awesome. I already bought it, though, so... There's that. Hello, stranger. Mm, I wish I could open that. I'll be right with you, Merch. Woohoo! Now. Welcome. I've got something new for you, mate. Okay, there's the TMP. Let's see. Flash grenade. What you see is what I've got. Okay, let me check my tune-up. Well, I think I need to draw fix that knife again. Not easy work. Alright. Okay. Well, unfortunately, there's nothing I can spend on. I mean, I got some if extra... If you want a fighting chance out there, you best tune up your kit. Okay. Well, let's see. Right. Are there any requests? Got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. Oh, right. <clears throat> Alright, I'll sell the pearl pendant and the vintage compass. I'll buy almost anything. Okay. Okay. Thank you. All right. Now let's see. Tune up. <sighs> okay. Uh, I know it's kind of a bit of a splurge, but I'm gonna. I'm just gonna max out the knife early. This kind of work is about finesse, stranger. Little bit goes a long way. You'll see. Yes. Anything yeah, I believe I got one more purchase before I max the knife out with this exclusive. <laughs> oh yeah. Come back anytime. anytime. All right. So my. Okay. All right. So... Was a bigger case not available yet? Nope. Bigger case is not available. A as of right now, there is no bigger case available. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. I just wonder if, like, if I can send. Ah, oh, man, I really wish I could s send that to storage because, like, let's see. Save. You should be able to send things to storage even when you're not around it. Yeah, I I I'm talking about the am. I'm talking about the sniper rifle ammo. Oh. Uh. Okay. So let's see. Um. Okay. Um. Take a look. Something's bound to catch your eye. Ooh, wait, a request. A dear friend of 
on. Okay. Sell three vipers. Reward for spinels. Is there a snipe charmer willing to lend a hand? Well, yes. I'll say yes, indeed. Okay. A snake charmer, you say? I would be more than happy to put some snakes to rest. In that case, I'm going to be a little bit more cautious. Oh yeah, I remember, there was like snakes in the swamp. I mean, I believe we're going to the swamp now. Oh! <gasps> I, kn I knew it! Oh yes! I just remember we're going through trees, so... Ah, uh, season's ripe for birds. Uh, I hear some birds nearby as well. <gasps> birds. Now. Equip. Careful. Oh, church. Crap. I made it. Mr. Bird. Actually, let me see if I can just reload. <laughs> okay. Okay, I see them. Church. I made it. And an exclusive treasure. Ooh, a grave digger. Don't worry. Very quiet. Just. Very quiet. Just like a mouse. That was oh like the one guy that wasn't infected. Oh, that sucks. Too bad. I, I, I feel. I kind of feel bad now. There's another bird. There's another bird. Okay. okay. Oh yes. I believe I can just, uh, I'm just gonna use, because I can't retrieve a bolt and I don't want to waste one, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, okay, I'm just gonna hope that they didn't hear that. Okay, some gunpowder. And I believe that there's somebody in there. Okay, and you say bolts will be very useful inside the castle? E yes. Okay. Particularly um, explosive bolts when you can okay, got create it. those. Aha! Hello! Wham! Oh! So Okay. And sit down. Some, some gunpowder and some resources. Man, I have a lot of resources. And I got a lot of explosives. So wait. Hand grenades. Let's see. I just wonder. I mean, I suppose I could splurge on... Oh, well, I'm just going to wait till I get one more piece of gunpowder. And then I will uh, get, craft myself two packs of... I'll craft myself two packs of... Emerald! Uh, two packs of handgun bullets. Okay. <gasps> okay. It, oh, great, another chicken's egg. Okay, so let's see. Let's see. Let's see. That symbol. That symbol. Okay. So, uh, I'm just going to call it the X, the V, and the Z, the Z, and the M. 
There's another X. Okay. I'm going to assume that the cats, the, uh, this, the, the, the OG cat's eye puzzle is going to be a lot more complex. Okay. Here we go. Damn it. Okay. Gondor one to roost. The church is sealed up. And maybe Eagle? Negative. Nothing yet. But they sure do have this place locked up tight. I see. I can think of one reason they'd want to do so. Oh, she's here. That's for sure. I'll find a way in. Condor 1, out. Okay. Let's open this. Ooh, a red gemstone ring. Let me take a look at that. First selling only an old ring that is rich with history. Okay. So far, nothing. Love in the background the mountains that you can see. Yeah, I, it's like that is a definite uh, improvement from the OG because you can just see the mountains. Like before, it was yeah. just nothing but the ocean. Yeah, no, it adds a whole lot of depth. Yeah. The mountains in Spain. Let's see. And that's going to be locked from the other side. Okay. Did they teach him lock picking in the academy? Yeah, didn't they teach you lock picking in the academy? Yeah. So, ooh, another request. Hmm. All right. These traitorous twins should not be allowed to rest in peace for joining that evil cult. We won't let someone, anyone, destroy the emblems engraved upon their tombstones. Okay, destroy the tombstone emblems. Okay. Okay. Ooh, the elegant headdress! Ooh, that's a what? Now, that is a very pretty find. I mean, I guess it's a better improvement than that puzzle, but let's just check up here in case the puzzle has been moved. Flash grenade. That can't be it. I mean, that can't be it, right? Now, let me just shoot the tin cans just to see. Yeah, I was just just want just wanted to shoot the tin cans to see. Hiya! Is there somebody in here? Nope. I mean, I can see through it, so it's the only person who could hide in there without me noticing would be a very small child. Alright, so let's destroy the em... Okay. So, destroy the emblems. I guess that's a bit more... Alright. I'll take care... Okay. That's one. Okay. So far. Grave robber okay. complete. All right, I'll turn that in and get the laser sight. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Okie okay, dokie. Okay. Just want to make sure I'm a grave robber extraordinaire. All right, now let's head back and get, turn that into the merch. <laughs> oh, yes, 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 yes. At long last, I'll get it. Okay. Took right. care of her request, did ya? Well, look at you. Well then, what can I do you for? Trade. Hmm. I mean, if only I hadn't splurged on my Sentinel-9, I'd have gotten the Punisher. But for now, I'll settle for the laser sight. <laughs> Good instinct, stranger. Yes, indeed. Okay. Anything else I can help you with? Come back. I think that's it for now. Okay. 
<laughs> yes. <laughs> oh yes. Okay, so uh, I've got some large resources here. Crafting bolts. Oh, I can make more bolts. I want to say there's a way to change your laser sight color, but I can't recall. Um, I think there's actually a mod for that. Time. Oh, no, it's in game. Oh, it is. Okay. Yeah, because well, I I changed mine to blue. Okay. So let's see. I don't know if it's through examining the laser Maybe. sight itself or if it's from the typewriter. I can't recall. Mm. Well, um, we're since we're right next to a typewriter. Let's see. Customize case. Storage. Um, hmm. Let's see. What can I send to storage? Okay. Well, either way, um, let me just equip this. I'm gonna reload. There we go. Now. Now. Yeah. Oh, look at that. It's like, when I'm moving forward, it act the laser feels a lot more stable, whereas if I'm sitting still, it feels kind of, I don't know, shaky. Oh yeah, it's the, oh yeah, I got the enhanced laser sight mod. And, uh, so the laser goes longer and further. Hmm, I wonder if, what would happen if I were to ring the bell. I just want to make, let's see. Yeah! Aww. I uh, man, I really wanted that bell to ring. Maybe you need like a heavy. Wait, I can climb up there. Well then. Okay, that's locked. Wait, wait a minute. I get it. Huh? Let's see. Okay. A piss. A uh, fro. Uh. I no, let me outside. Has I don't know, real life lock around the church and await orders from your lord. Until then, keep the church door shut. The key will be held in the cave on the other side of the lake. The monster will deal with this foolish intruder. Ah, yes, Delago. Lake. Let's hope for no more surprises. Keep her locked in the church until the appointed time. Okay. Okay, it seems like I'm going to need another key. I mean, just by looking at that, yeah, I'm going to need another key. Okay. Well, let's go down. All right. I'm not sure if I should unlock the door just yet. Lago. Lake. Alright. Alright, now I can... Here he is. Oh! <laughs> yeah! That was awesome! Toasty. Toasty. Toasty! Okay, next time that happens, uh, I'm just, I'm not gonna make the toasty joke. Just, uh, put it in the, um, uh, post, put it in the, uh, have the toasty guy pop up in the footage whenever, you know, a, a successful... Oh gosh. Meanie! Sorry, must have slipped. Okay. Gunpowder, yes. Okay. Crafting. <laughs> All right, that'll settle me. 
some more gunpowder. Oh! Haha! <laughs> Got Oh no no! Oh no 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 no! Wait a minute! Pow! Haha! <laughs> Not bad, right? Strip! Strip! Oh yeah! Okay. Does that do less damage to your knife than just doing the instant shot? Yeah, it does way less damage. Plus, like, I, plus it's fun to swipe every now and then. Okay. Oh yeah, in case you're wondering why I haven't used any of the eggs yet. Oh boy. Okay. Oh, so they got fire bombs now. That's. Okay. <laughs> that was a weird spaz. Oh! They got mul- Oh! 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 Okay, so, yeah. Let's see what we've got. Yeah, I caused an interesting glitch when I had was going through the castle at one point. Yeah? I killed a Ganado just as its head was uh, bursting to sh reveal the Plaga. Yeah. And so it had it died, but it had the animation happen, so the Plaga was just like glitching out. It was just going all over the place, the head. Whoa! It, it didn't know what to do because it was supposed to still be alive, but I killed it right before that happened. Wow, that's uh, that is one weird glitch. Yeah, it was very interesting. I was like, wow, that's fascinating. Okay, come on. That should have... To oh, come on! You're still not toasty enough? Come on. Get toasty. <sighs> okay. Well, it seems like there's quite the amount of resources around. I mean, even it's like it feels like even on hardcore, they're like loading you up with resources. What oh, the? It, it's ridiculous, honestly. <laughs> like the lake portion of this, it's massive. Yeah, because like we get the, to it. Yeah, because like uh, he said that um, um, uh, Nero said that. Oh, son of. Uh, Neryl said that uh, rather than the three docks in the original, there's now over a dozen. There's now over a dozen places to visit. Yeah. Yeah. There's... It, it's a lot. Oh yeah. Well, in that in my case... playthrough, I had to cut it down so much in my playthrough just to get it moving. Otherwise, yeah. it was gonna be like three episodes of me treasure hunting and stuff. Yeah. Wow, that sounds like fun. Like. That sounds like a lot of fun. Wait. Let's see. Okay. That's right. Let's see. Okay, so there's some way to get down there. And let's see if there's some way I'm... Let's see. Maybe that I had... Uh, well, judging by the fact that there's a dock down there, maybe there's a lake. Uh, uh, maybe that's part of the lake. So, I'll have to come back to that later. You could shoot those torches in the OG, and it would count towards your accuracy. Okay. Is that for every version? I don't know. I know like, some it, of them... You couldn't damage, like, in yeah. some versions, you could shoot the torches and they would go out, and then other versions, it wouldn't work. Yeah, because it's, yeah, that's right. Okay. Here, I believe, is going to be our first fight with the, um, uh, the El Gigante. Okay. Let's see. All right, let's see. Oh, another request. Somebody needs to make a mod where, um, Leon is Kratos. Yeah. Taking on. <laughs> Good luck finding oh, someone big enough to use this thing. I mean, if there was a way to destroy, I mean, I, I don't suppose there's any way to destroy that because I have a nasty feeling that's gonna be used for the El Gigante. Let's see, large resources. 
Large resources and kitchen knives. Okay. I'm gonna hold off on crafting any more bolts for just just for right now. Okay, quarry the fish farm. Uh, progress for the blue medallions. Okay. I've just noticed like there's a lot less uh, uh, files to pick up compared to the original. <gasps> oh! Shut up! No! Don't dare get up! Come here. Come here, doggo. It's also, like, kind of disturbing how they've made the, um, how they've made the dogs, uh, uh the, like, the, the Plaga-possessed wolves way more distinctive. I know what to do here. After all. No, no, no! That was a waste of a flashbang grenade. Wait, you got one more? Yeah. I know I got more. one more, but still, like. Right about there. Should Boom! Shakalaka! And they're all bloody dead! Let's see. Just hope that's all of them. More money in a belt. Okay, bonus for, uh, thanks to the case perk. Okay. So it seems like I can't get into any of these until the El Cagante is unleashed. Well. <gasps> Aha! I was hearing something about that. The quarry and the fish farm, they said. Did you, uh, how many blue medallions did you find around here? I honestly can't recall. Because, like, I know there's five, there's five that have to be shot, and I so far I only found one. I, I want to say, though, I think you can view the map if you wanted to. Map, right, okay. Okay, so there's a treasure in the church, and there's a locked drawer. Did you already find the little thing that asks you to hunt the blue medallions? Yeah, I did. So it should sh Oh, yeah, so you're right. So it should show up. Okay. Okay, let's see. Okay, so no, that's not the right key. And so far, I, I'm really disturbed that I haven't found any more uh, wind up, uh, uh, wind up, um, little Salazar guys. Yeah, Salazars. They are very well hidden because yeah. I think I'm at the island right now, and I think I've maybe found five. Yeah, because they're supposed to be 18, and like there's an audio cue for them, so like um. There's an audio cue, so like you'll hear like this buzz buzz sound, which means that you know they're nearby. Wow! A hexagon piece, so that's a key item. Hmm. Ooh. There are enough weapons here to get a party going. <laughs> yep. <clears throat> Instead of letting your unused guns collect dust, why not sell them and spend the extra cash to upgrade a gun you do use? When you sell a weapon you get tuned up, you'll get all the expenses you put into it back. There's no catch, mate. We're just rooting for you. Well, there's that is so nice. That is so nice of the merchant. I, I'm so pleased with, with what Capcom's doing. Ooh, is there a shooting gallery? Yep, I love what they did with it here. Oh yeah, pirates! Token machines. You can use 
three silver or gold tokens at the token machine to win a random charm. The more gold tokens you use, the greater your chances. Great! So instead of the bottle caps, like seems like. All right. Destroy the pirates and shoot for the high score. Weapons and ammo are limited. It's all free. Earn tokens based on your score for a chance to win magnificent prizes. Prizes. Exchange your tokens for charms at the token machine. They're full of treasures that can be found nowhere else. Tips and tricks. You can destroy several targets at once by shooting dynamite to set off an explosion. Be careful. Shooting a sailor will deduct points from your score. Some targets cannot be destroyed with one shot. Shoot as many times, uh, shoot as many shots as it takes until they break. In addition, if certain conditions are met, bonus targets will be added. However, these conditions will change from game to game. There's only one rule. Shoot the targets as they pop up. Simple enough, am I right? Oh, man. If you do well, I'll make it worth your while. Knickknacks and whatnot. Anyway. <clears throat> I think that's a quiche right there. Uh, some, uh, some bread rolls. Looks like some steak. And some fries. Oh, man. Oh, boy. This is getting me going. So. Rely too much on a single weapon, and you'll find yourself out of ammo, mate. All right. Let's see. Bonus condition. 100% obtain. Okay. Alrighty then, so, uh, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to cut the footage right here, and then we'll be right back for some, uh, uh some game time. So. Let's see. Oh, look at that. So, 